morning. Good morning. Welcome back to uh, morning coffee. As some would say, I'd call it a little night coffee. Over that, there, if, I, if you can hear me. That too. We're kind of What'd you say? Uh, Just... In case you're wondering why he's sitting all the way over there, is we have a chair right here. We're going to be talking about today on dorm room hacks, number one. Hope you enjoy. Enjoy. <laughs> guys today in the uh, morning coffee this is gonna be our new uh, Monday uh, video series dorm room hacks just easy stuff you can do in the dorm room to make it a little, little nicer for you if you're gonna be living there the whole you know whole year basically eight months that yeah, much yeah up. nine I think actually if, you're, if you want to be technical you want to be technical you know that's that's all right <coughs> I'll be technical <laughs> and there's times that are not times that they're less expensive <laughs> <laughs> Easy! <laughs> Alright guys, so this is a basic dorm room chair. What you got here, you got your basic construction. <laughs> you know, wood, <laughs> cushion, breaks it. the back. But as you can... The legs and everything else, and everything else. As there. you can see here, guys, <laughs> it's an open back, you know, to hey the... It's an open back to the chair. You know, it's not conducive for good posture sitting. Uh, so... Basically, a freaking cardboard bottom. What are we sitting on? <laughs> <laughs> so, so basically, what we got here, guys, is a piece of cardboard we got from an Amazon Prime box. You probably get a lot of those. The Amazon we Prime box. We folded it up a bunch of times, and we placed it in the back here. And we used shipping tape, which I recommend everybody who comes to college bring a roll of shipping tape. Or you, you can use duct tape. Yeah, you can use it anywhere in the dorm room. It's good stuff. But yeah, we use shipping also, tape. On there, get that thing, whatever you call that, cutter. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's a, that's a, that's a hack of itself, you know. It is, yeah. So good that's, stuff. that's good stuff right there. But you're gonna want to put this in the back corner, okay? Or in the back lower portion, so it's gives good lumbar support. Did they see a big hole in the back? Oh yeah, okay. yeah. We showed them the big hole. That's why. That's why we could have put this thing here in the first place. Then you're gonna want to get yourself one. You're gonna want to get oh. yourself one of these. It's just a basic lumbar support cushion type deal with side bolstering. You can pick it up for about 15 bucks on Amazon. Okay. Sorry. So a little, yeah, a little, yeah. I'll show them inside. Yeah. You know, a little cushion in there. It looks like a tempur pedic pretty much. It's that's not. what it feels like. Zip it back up. You well, can that's find what it, it feels like. like. Yeah, you can find it on Amazon. Just type in like chair cushion. Back. Oh, uh, it has a strap. Make sure it has a strap. All you do, real simple, guys. Put it on. We can't make this stuff up. Put it on this. Put it on the chair like this, because without the cardboard, like it would just slip there. under. But now with the cardboard. It stays firm in here. So here, let's, here. Yeah, here. Sit. Yeah. No, you take a seat. Yeah. So all you do. Yeah. Well, I'm way out of the shot, but yeah. Uh, but uh, you can see the the torso part where you want. Yeah. Here we gotta get we gotta move it up here. Oh, perfect. Yeah, right there. All right. So all you do, guys, just sit on the chair like this. With it's good cushion. You know what I mean. You're sitting there typing at your desk. It's adjustable. You can. You can move it around, you know what I mean? It's good it's good for you. So Yeah, I can like total that, that spot. That's nice. In total raw material cost, probably twenty bucks. Zero. Zero. Why is it zero? Um, <clears throat> technically, you know. It's a raw material cost. <laughs> <laughs> oh my. Just kidding. How much was this? Twenty bucks? No, this is about fifteen, sixteen bucks on Amazon. Oh, uh, raw material so, for the box and yeah, the tape? No, the shipping tape, you know, you uh, got that. So okay. Yeah, that's true. Yeah. Twenty bucks. Okay, I see it now. Not zero. You're you're getting scratch that. X that. X it. Slick it. <laughs> you call there? Yeah. Well we don't talk about that, but <laughs> Oh, there it is. Oh, <laughs> yeah, but anyway, guys, this is the first hack because you're you're gonna spend you know a good amount of time maybe in your room doing homework, and you know you wanna sit nice. You know no, what I mean? Hundred percent. Yeah, I'm always in my dorm, as Steve says, like this. <laughs> this guy is at a he, wait. Did we put that back at the down? It's good. Are you, are you just our heads? <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, He's I sit like, like this. <laughs> With my back literally <laughs> above everything else. Yeah. yeah and I don't know. It, I don't sit like this. He comes in the room and the chair is like two feet away from the desk. He's sitting all the way <gasps> typing away. That is either my 
study stage, my study, study stage. set, or okay. I don't even notice that how bad of a uh, seat I'm at or how bad of a angle okay. I'm at. I just get in the zone, I guess, you know? You get that, you know? Oh, yeah, guys, but this is easy stuff. Uh, if you have a cardboard box, keep it. There's a lot of uses. I'm, you can even, I bet, you can even make one of these out of cardboard. These? Yeah, absolutely. I mean, it's not going to have cushion, but it's going to have support. Lumbar. You, these chairs have the opposite of lumbar support. Lumbar support would be like, you know, this, you know, this, you know, the curvature of your back like this. These chairs go like this. It doesn't make any sense. You're, it's going to fold you, your back yeah, the opposite way. True. You don't want that. And they're hard. hard. And like your spine kind of gets Yeah, and this bar off. like pierces yeah. the top of your back. Here's what you, big true. line. All you have to do, guys, ready? Slip it up a bit. Man, you're going places. Yes, you are. That just gets your day started well. It does. Watching this and having your lumbar support. It does. It makes me. That's my cup of tea. Actually, yeah, we'll George. Thanks. George. It's a coffee. Mm -hmm. cup, of, cup of Joe. Cup of George. You know? <laughs> it's going south real fast. <laughs> but anyway, uh, so Mondays are going to be dorm room hacks. Next week, we're going to be talking about optimal desk setups in the dorm. <sighs> Conducive for studying habits. Oh, Guys, boy. I tell you what, I changed my desk setup. My productivity has gone from here to about right here. <laughs> Hey, that's, a, that's an increase of I'm That's saying. an increase of about this much, but it's noticeable. Technically, you know, we're being technical here. That's probably about 3%. 3%? You, you calculated it? Yeah. He did the math before. What? The did, you math. Math. did you round it to 3%? Uh, carry the one. <laughs> tax. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, but anyway, we're going to talk about dorm setups. It's going to be sweet. Yeah. Uh, but Make Wednesdays sure now. Check in. Yeah. yeah. Wednesdays are going to be uh, book days. Book days, yes. Book days. Mm -hmm. We're reading the book every morning. Uh, what do we get, like 20, 30 minutes? Maybe more than that? Yeah. Well, we drink our coffee, we read our books. So we'll, mm -hmm. be, uh, we'll be interested uh, to show you what we've been reading. It's good stuff. Um, give you what we learned. Little finance tips, actually. Yeah, so it's just basically going to be summaries of what we're... Just something interesting we've read. Yeah. Uh, Fridays, have we, have we got anything for Friday? Fridays are... Up in the air still? Up in the air. It's right. a coin flip, guys. Up in the air. Well, just wait till wait till Friday. We're gonna have good, some quality content. Yeah, it'll be quality. I, I know. <laughs> <laughs> well, uh, by that sound, we're out of time, guys. Thanks for joining us with the dorm room hacks number one. All right, guys. This has been Steve and Luke, and we will uh, we'll see you next time. Take it easy.